hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video and today i am going to be relaxing my hair so it's been about i think eight weeks the last time i relaxed my hair was the first time i relaxed my hair after the cut was on the 23rd of december i think somewhere around that but it was just before christmas so it's been about eight weeks now and my hair is like grown a lot like i have a lot of growth to a point where my hair is actually starting to break up here on top because of the growth when i comb it and the back also needs like a proper legs on the side and rain is here with me she's busy going in her room and in here so if you hear her make noise i do apologize for that in advance so yeah and to relax my hair i'm going to use this ors relaxer and this is the no line relaxer i always like to use the no line because you can mix the whole thing at home yourself and um it's actually good for sensitive skin since i have like sensitive scalp so it's good for sensitive scalp and i got it from clicks it was 105 so inside the box there's um, a wrapping mousse which I always use. I'm not going to use my design essential today. I'm going to use this ORS one that came with the relaxer. And then there's a shampoo which I always use after using the um, neutralizing shampoo. I'm going to use this thing. And there's also a conditioner and the relaxer and the activator and there's also some gloves which i don't use i like use the latest gloves because this ones just slide off and there's also a moisturizer and there's also like instructions here so i already have my gloves on i'm going to apply some petroleum jelly around the edges and on my ears to help prevent burning And now I am mixing the activator and the relaxer together. And now I'm done, it's smooth. I'm going to apply using my brush, which I use all the time when I color line relax my hair. I should actually get a new one starting to like bend up here. So I'm going to start with the back and the sides since that's where I have the most growth. And then I work my way to what's the top.
So now I am done applying my relaxer all over the hair. I am taking my retail comb and I'm going to comb my relaxer. So I'm done mixing everything, I'm just gonna wait for an additional 10 minutes and then I'll go and do the shower. So I am back from rinsing my hair, now it's time to rub. I'm going to first apply my leave-in conditioner which is the Cantu Shea Butter Leave-in Conditioner and as always I like to apply a little bit, not too much. I'm going to apply this all over my hair. So now I'm taking my um, Denman brush, I'm just brushing my hair. So I'm going to part my hair this time. I'm going with the side part. And to wrap my hair, I'm going to use this wrapping lotion that came with the relaxer. I'm not going to use my design essential one. And now I'm taking my rapid strips and these are the large ones. So I'm going to use them to wrap my hair. another one just to reinforce and make sure everything is wrapped So 
I'm not going to sit in the dryer. I'm just going to go ahead and do my chores because it's still early in the morning. And I have some ironing to do. So I'm just going to go ahead and do some ironing. Maybe load a dishwasher or something. And then my once my hair is dry, I'll come back and style. So now I'm back with my hair all dry. I'm just going to remove these strips. So next I'm going to apply my Jamaican black castor oil. And to curl my hair I'm going to use my mini straightener that I got from Clicks. So first I'm just going to comb my hair. So I'm going to start curling my hair from the middle.
So now I am done curling all my hair. So I'm just taking my white tooth comb and I'm going to comb these curls out. So this is the final result. This is how my hair looks. Like curling took me like 10 minutes tops. So this is how the back looks. And the sides. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye.